Yes, that is an actress shopping for her own costumes, but she's not buying them for the next play she's in. The resident ensemble players are selling off old costumes to make room for new costumes for future plays. And the university is actually very lucky to have such a company because most theater companies are not like that. We have a resident acting company which not only performs professional plays here, but also teaches at the university. And they teach a number of undergraduate classes in both performance and in speech and voice. Here at the Rep, the stages aren't the only things built by hand. They pay often the same amount of detail and attention to the costumes each character wears. Well now, after 17 years, these costumes are being sold just in time for Halloween. We have a professional costume shop in Hartshorn, and they have gone through all of their storage, and they have pulled out almost over 2,000 pieces of costumes and masks and coats and capes, all kinds of things that we are now offering for sale to the public just in time for Halloween. We don't really have a good reason for waiting 17 years other than it was the first break we had in our cycle of working that we could actually organize a sale. So um, we thought it would be a great opportunity actually to have the sale so that people would come in and see what we do, actually. And they would see, you know, oh my gosh, people build these costumes. We have designers from all over, actually. As in the last 17 years, we've done over 150 productions. I would venture to guess there's over 2,000 costume pieces in the sale. Many people are walking away happily with their new stage-worthy costumes to show off for Halloween. This is Joanne Vu from STN 49.